Hey you guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be taking you guys along on a day of my life. It's a Sunday. This vlog is actually from last week and then I thought I lost the vlog footage and I went on Instagram and asked you guys if you still wanted to see it because I recovered the vlog footage and everyone said yes. So here's my morning doing a little skincare, starting the day off right and I'm just going to be taking you guys along my day, prepping for summer classes, showing you guys a tour of our garage gym. Here's me making a bagel sandwich it was delicious and yeah let's just get started subscribe if you're new here by the way hee <laughs> hee why did i just say hee hee that was like so weird hi guys what's up welcome back to my channel it's a lovely sunday morning and well now it's about 12 p.m but i've just been doing a little morning routine before I really started this video. I woke up, I had coffee, I made myself a bagel sandwich, and then I've been really into reading right now. I've been reading on my iPad, The Hate You Give. Um, it was a book a lot of you guys recommended to me, and it has absolutely just impacted me so hard and i love it i highly suggest you guys check it out as well i'm almost done with it and as soon as i'm done with it i'm watching the movie version on hulu because apparently it's really good um i've already cried so that's that it is just so good so eye-opening and it's a kind of a lot about police brutality and all of that and it's definitely something to read in light of recent events i am reading your guys's messages responding reading new articles listening to new podcasts about black lives matter and everything else in between and it is crazy how much we've learned and i'm so grateful to be able to have a platform where i can share what i'm learning with you guys i don't know if that whole thing was out of focus so i'm sorry but um yeah i just wanted you guys to know i'm here i love you guys i'm here for you and i'm constantly learning and i want you guys to keep me accountable um, but I thought it'd be fun to get back to some fun vlogs. Today is a Sunday. I started my online summer classes a couple days ago on Friday. I'm taking online marketing and I'm also doing a 20 page paper on how COVID-19 affected fashion businesses because I was supposed to do a New York May semester for my major for fashion merchandising and it got canceled obviously. So instead we could either do the trip next May or if you wanted to just get it over with, you could write a paper over the summer. So I chose the paper because I want to be able to graduate next May and not have to like graduate and then like go on the May semester to get the credits. Cause it's like three credits hours that you get for the trip. So I decided to go that route. So I just, um, I looked at everything on Friday. I went, I, we had like had a zoom intro for one of my classes. Um, but I just I kind of want to go through my marketing syllabus in particular, put that stuff in my calendar. Um, I've just got some random stuff to do. I want to be able to work out at some point, but I thought this would be a fun little vlog. So my battery died while I was talking last, and why is the brightness just not here? I let my camera charge for a bit, and now I am going through my marketing syllabus, and I'm putting down when all my exams are, and assignments are due, everything of the sorts. Um, I think it's going to be not too much of a heavy workload which will be nice i'm not really sure um and i also just pulled out my um doing well daily journal you guys know i've been loving doing this there's a quote on it every day that you can outline with a brush pen it's literally doingwelldaily.com i think um and today's quote was if you have to force it just leave it alone and i love that so it was fun wrote down some stuff i wanted to knock out today i haven't gotten to write down my gratitude and words to live by yet but um yeah, I've been kind of sitting in front of my computer or reading all morning, so I kind of want to like get moving, do a little something fun. Um, I've got my fun little pink set on. I'm going to head downstairs. Actually, I don't think I've really like showed you guys. Um, while I was gone, my brother really took the home gym, garage gym to heart and really got after it. And I kind of helped a little bit. I bought um, some big mirrors that we could hang up. Um, and obviously I have my Peloton down there and some other things. Um, but yeah, it's been a really great place to work out. It's been a really, honestly, just great escape to just go down there and get some workout in. I'll probably go on the bike and do a little cardio, nothing crazy, and then do more of a floor workout, I think. So I'm going to bring you guys down with me, take off my blue light glasses, and let's get to work. All right, you guys, welcome to our garage gym. It's definitely been a work in progress and I'm so proud of my brother and my dad honestly they've kind of been working on it together need to get a Georgia flag though that seems wrong but yeah basically he got all these basically everything's from Amazon I'm pretty sure he got a lot of these foam mats we could do workouts he's if you guys didn't know he's um 
on the Furman men's soccer team now, so he's got to keep training, obviously, since they can't be training at school. Um, so that's kind of like been his inspiration, I guess. Um, but yeah, first off, when you walk in, we've got my, my baby bike here, my little Peloton. Um, this is pretty much where I am a lot of the times. We've got lots of fans all over. Brought my JBL boombox in here. All kinds of wipes, sanitizers, everything. So that after we use, you know, different machines and everything, we wipe them all down since Freddie and I and, like, my dad and my mom have been in here. Um, and then here is, like, where Freddie does most of his stuff. I've been coming here for sure and doing some stretching. I learned a TikTok dance here the other day. Um, we've got foam rollers. Um, and then I'll just come here and do arms. I did, like, a Chloe Ting ab workout, just, like, different things like that. This is something, half BOSU ball, I don't know. Most of the stuff is Freddy's and my dad's because um, they do their workouts here. They haven't been going to the gym. Who even knows? I don't know. This thing I've kind of used a couple times. <laughs> but yeah, it's really cool. We've got a TRX, which I've been also using as well. Maybe I'll do that today. A little punching bag, and they're all held up with these really cool clamps. And there's also a pull-up bar. I've got a step stool here to get up there because it's kind of high up. But um, yeah, so that's kind of the layout. Um, so yeah, it's a good time. I definitely really like it. It's been a safe space for when I'm just like in a really bad mood. I'm so beyond thankful that I can come down here because basically what happened was we would always, our garage would just always be full. We always had to clean it out. We never were able to pull cars in here because there was just stuff everywhere. And we were like, then let's just like actually make it a room basically because we're just never gonna park our cars in the garage. Don't know if you guys do that. So highly suggest it. Oh, here's my purse, that's weird. We've got like jump ropes and different resistant bands here. It's pretty great. So we're gonna open up the garage door just to let some air in. I'm gonna turn on the fans because it gets nice and humid in here, let me tell you. Um, and this fan is my favorite. It works wonders, actually. Oh, great. All right, let's get to working out. I can see the fire that we made just to save us When we try to make up for never letting go Said the things we promised not to say that we break up Just to start all over even though we know This is the hard way better We can't be hard Okay, we did it guys. Big workout, it was great. I had some fun. Gotta put the weights away. My brother's very on me about like putting your stuff back. Gotta love that. I actually just got bit by like a ton of mosquitoes, like my whole leg. Yeah, that's not good. I don't know if it's cause it just rained, so it's like extra humid and buggy. I don't really know, but I literally have to stop working out cause I just can't stop itching. So yeah, it was good. I feel good. Nice little sweat, a little glisten. All right, guys, so my mom and I just decided that we're gonna go for a bike ride. She just got back from running some errands. I changed into this green set because my pink one was a little see-through, if you know what I mean. This one's more like you can actually wear it in public, I feel like, on a bike ride. The other one, I don't know. Anyways, my justification, not needed. We are gonna go for a bike ride to a juice place and get some green juice. I already had some lunch, been chatting on the phone with some people and I'm doing more of the syllabus stuff, so my mom and I are gonna Go for a bike ride. It's not raining, but it's super overcast. But it's not supposed to rain anymore. So it's I feel like it's perfect so we're not like sweating. So windy! Uh, yeah, it's an extra high resistance. It's one, two, one, two. All right, we got the goods. Got one for tomorrow as well. She got a little one. She got the green Goliath. We're, we're gonna ride around a little bit more. Quick stop to the marina with our juices.
biked down to our favorite spot here. You guys know how I do it. I like to sit down on the rocks. Oh, oh that's spiky. Oh, hey there. She went a little further than me. We're going shopping in the grocery store. I need kombucha. She needs things. Green tea. Green tea? Let's do it. Hard to be on, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know when you like <laughs> A lemon water. Big lemon water you got I there. Know. Well, it's just lemon. <laughs> you add it to your water. You want to breathe? <laughs> like, we're like out of breath from our bike ride and it's like breathing with the mask on is not it right now. All right guys, we just got back. I'm sweaty. It started to rain on us on our way back. Just like drizzling though, so it's like okay. Um, but yeah, we stopped by um, the grocery store. Like there's like a little market and I got some kombucha. Anyways, I'm gonna hop in the shower because I'm gross because I obviously worked out this morning too. And then it's like cozy out. I think I'm gonna go pick up some Thai food for my dad and I, bring it over to his house. I'm probably gonna watch a movie. All right, just showered and popped on this fit. This big jacket is from Aritzia, Lululemon shorts, my Vince slip-ons, and then I packed a little bag. So I'm gonna sleep over at my dad's house tonight. I'm gonna, I just ordered us some Thai food. I'm gonna go pick that up and then head over. Oh, baby, I got chicken and broccoli. He got some veggie thing. Very good, very good. I'm going to pour some kombucha, but dad wanted to vlog. Okay, what are you doing? Hey, uh, I guess I'm vlogging. <laughs> How you doing there, girls and guys? Uh, I've never really vlogged. I'm done vlogging now, okay? <laughs> bye bye. All right, guys, I'm pouring myself a little kombucha in a wine glass. Been doing this lately instead of just like having a casual drink of wine all the time, and kombucha is just so great. So, we're drinking the gingerberry wine. This one I had to show my ID for some reason, just because whatever, but. I've been really into just drinking kombucha out of the wine glass. How to suggest? All right, guys. So we've heard that this Jerry Seinfeld like comedy show was good. It's on Netflix. It's called Twenty Three Hours Ooh. to Kill. So we just finished watching the Seinfeld um, comedy special on Netflix. It was so funny. I was actually laughing out loud. Like it was so funny. Like I've never really watched any of his stuff. I've never really watched Seinfeld or anything, and it was hilarious. Just talking about like everyday funny stuff, and that's like my favorite humor. Um, so yeah, I'm actually in my room now at my dad's house. It's so it's definitely 100 percent nicer than my mom's, and I just never come here because my dad's always at work, and when he gets off work, my family's just super close that he'll like come over to our house for a little bit. We all hang out, or I don't know. I don't come here enough, and I know it, and I've been trying to make an effort for sure. It's just like. We see each other so much that by the end of the night, he's like, okay, I'm just gonna go home, go to bed. Like, you can just sleep here. Like, I don't know. It's just like weird. I have all my stuff at my mom's house, but I'm gonna go to bed. I hope you guys enjoy today's vlog. I love you guys so, so, so much. Subscribe if you're new here, and I'll see you guys very soon for another video. Bye bye.